a very good day my sure from wherever you are tuned in from this is prince sky tv and i'm your host dj kai kai the prince if it is your first time to join us then don't forget to subscribe share comment and like due to public demand from the previous topic today i have prepared something special for you if you are in a relationship or you are building a new relationship then watch to the last minute and you will thank me later how to build and maintain a healthy and healthy relationship forget about any challenge going around in any relationship and concentrate on how to build a healthy and healthy relationship number one be honest if you want to have a healthy relationship then be honest to yourself and with your partner never doubt yourself or never doubt your partner because having doubt in your relationship is just like injecting poison into your food because it will damage and kill your relationship slowly by slowly then have trust and be honest whatever you are doing be honest and take trust and faithfulness ahead as your weapon to win the best remember when you are in a war you have to be straightforward and backward never cause moving backward is just like killing your own dignity number two, creating time creating time for your partner will enable you to study or learn more about what your partner love or hate if you don't create time then you are killing your own self or you are killing your own marriage time is a factor to build a healthy relationship because if you don't cultivate something then don't prepare to reap so building time will allow you to reap the best from whatever your partner is doing or whatever your partner asks for you number three, having a realistic expectation having a realistic expectation will enable you to sow the best because you cannot be everything but you be something that you have prepared yourself for don't ever compare yourself to your friend or your neighbor relationship build your own relationship and have realistic on how to march forward remember if you copy some someone's relationship then you cannot understand the steps which he or she has gone through to have what he or she is enjoying so build your own relationship have the realistic deep inside your heart and work with your formula your fingertips this will allow you to have the best family or the best marriage you ever dreamt of number four touching formula holding hands with your partner works miracles most of the people often fall in holding hands with their mpango akando but not their real loved ones remember when you hold hands with your loved ones you deepen your relationship even 10 times more than how it is holding her hands touching her knees her belly back neck and even her hair will soften her heart and make her more comfortable with your love and his her feelings by making her feel more romantic for you don't ever allow a single day to pass by you without holding your partner closer tight to you this will make her comfortable eased and softened by your emotional touch when you touch her in a romantic way don't allow your partner to just watch in the tv how people are holding their hands together happily and you have never imagined making her feel the same experience she has been watching on tv number five speaking your mind speaking your mind will allow you settle down all the stress you are going through maybe from deep your relationship 
or maybe at your working environment. And remember, problem shared is problem solved. So whatever it's paining you, share with your partner. Because there is no any other person who can understand you just like how your partner will handle you and will have the best advice for you because he or she wants the best for you. So speak your mind and ashamed the devil. Tell your partner what is paining you. Number six, sex. Sex is another tool to maintain the best relationship. Some of the people take sex for granted. Maybe you just enjoy sex wherever you wish to have. Your partner has sexual rights like any other human wants. And regular sex will boost your confidence in front of your lover. Regular sex will boost a strong bone deep in your relationship and will deepen your relationship more and more and more so if you perform poorly then you are diminishing maximize your time properly use use the opportunity given remember opportunity comes once in a lifetime this is your lover and if you perform poorly then remember there is someone outside there who will be allowed to just get deep inside your bed and perform your duties because you cannot satisfy your lover the way she wants so when you are given a chance to operate, make sure you are using all the opportunity given. My friend, if it is hitting, just use all the formula and all the tactics you have in your fingertips to make sure your lover remained happy and happy forever. Number seven, being independent. Being independent will ever make you so the best because you do what you want to do by your own self never follow anybody rules to have the best for your own family or to have the best for you ensure you are doing what it's from your own heart and your own instincts ensure whatever you are doing is not from your friend is not from your family or is not from everyone being independent make your own rules independent make whatever you want to be independent make your judgment independent because if you apply someone's rule then you will not be able to solve any complication that might arise in future so being independent whatever you want to impose in your marriage let it be from your had this will allow you to have the best solution when a problem arises in the future because whatever has happened was just deep from your heart or your, from your mind so be independent number eight and the last one fight fairly whatever you are doing my friend you have to fight fairly don't take sides whatever you are doing ensure fairness is the key to all your solution be fair be fair to your partner be fair to your family be fair to whatever surrounds your relationship because in relationship we got four pillars yourself your family and the family of your partner so Anything you are doing, make sure you are not taking side. Ensure fairness emerges to be the hero in your relationship. And you will learn to the best and the best and healthy family. Remember, fairness is the key to peace. And peace is the key to development. And development is the key to a bright and a bright future so whatever you are doing have fairness and the fairness will balance the ecosystem between your family and your relationship 
Thank you guys for watching. Bye bye. Let's meet in the next episode. And don't forget to subscribe, like, share and comment. Let's meet in the next episode. In case of any topic you would like us to discuss, then drop it at the comment section and I will discuss for you.